We're with Emily Ruman of the Food and Water Watch in Cinnaminson. Uh, we're about uh, ready to start a um, awareness demonstration. Can you tell us why we're here? Um, so we're here today to ask Senator Diane Allen to stand up strong for a ban on fracking waste. Um, unfortunately, Governor Christie chose to veto the fracking waste ban. So we're out here making sure that Senator Diane Allen stands up strong for a ban on fracking waste here in New Jersey. What about other Republican legislators? Are you working with any of them to override the veto? Yep, we are actually holding a coordinated total of five call in actions around the state today, calling in to our assembly people all up and down the east coast of New Jersey, as well as here in western New Jersey. Um, great, so my name is Emily Ruman. I'm here on behalf of Food and Water Watch. I'm our South Jersey field organizer. We're out here today calling for Senator Diane Allen to stand up for a ban on fracking waste. We know that this waste is toxic. We do not want it discharged into our waterways, potentially threatening the drinking water of all people in New Jersey. Drilling for natural gas takes fresh water and uses it not for agricultural purposes or residential purposes, but for extreme industrial purposes, adding millions of gallons of chemicals to turn it into toxic fracking fluid. This is a tremendous misuse of our public resources. It also puts the health and safety of our communities at risk.